Hello, I'm Shane with Salamander Paddle Gear. Today we're going to talk to you a little bit about some of the fins that we have. We've got two different styles of fins. We've got side fins that we can be placed for FCS fin boxes, which are all these four outer boxes. They just slip in like so. Four and a half inch and a two inch. Then we also have what we call a longboard fins in a three inch for the river, eight inch for lakes. These set into this area and attach with the screw and plate, which I'll show next. So the longboard fins use what we call a screw and anchor plate and to put this in you simply stick it in here, follow the slot down, then take the screw back out, put the fin in, it's got a little metal tab, it slides through here into a slot, then back down and you simply line up the screw into the plate and screw it in. With ours we use a flathead screwdriver. Then on the side bite fins, the FCF fins, they all get screwed in with a small, what, what we call a little grub screw. And these grub screws are two on each side and it's best to use all four. So all our fins are made out of a urethane and this allows uh, for some flexibility which is great for rental purposes and people who want a fin that's very durable. This allows you to bang it on the rocks. Uh, if you drop the board and it hits the fin, most likely not going to break. Uh, whereas a real high-end fin, which these are not high-end fins, a real high-end fin would snap right off at the tabs or worse yet, it would break in the box and potentially snap the box off. So these are excellent fins for rental purposes and people just wanting a fin that they can really abuse, which is super critical when you're on the river. You absolutely want a fin that's flexible and can take the beatings from the rocks.